so today we'll talk be we'll talking about chords and secant and two theorems related to these all right so i draw a circle okay and then i mark uh, four points we'll call them a b c d now what i do is i draw these diagonals if you want to call them connect these two points all right and let us suppose they meet at this point okay this point uh, i'll call this okay oh now an interesting property is that the product of these two okay ao into co will be equal to the product of these two and we are going to prove this okay let me write this down once ao times co is bo time du or it's a very very easy proof okay so if you just uh, take bo down to the left hand side and co to the right hand side you will already see that somewhat similar triangles are somehow related to this one and yes they are the intuition is correct we will find two similar triangles and then we will get this ratio very easily all right now here is the important part after this you can you can do this yourself what i'll do is i'll join these two lines all right bc and ad fine let me also draw dc and ab now a b c d is a cyclic quadrilateral right all the four points they are on the circumference now see this angle will be obviously equal to this one aod boc vertical opposite angles and these two will also be equal right if you draw this part bcb and this one then these two will be equal we are using the properties of cyclic quadrilateral here and these two angles being equal also follows you see similar thing happens from that's this side also all right now that you have two similar triangles you can easily find the two similar triangles and prove this so pause this video and try to approach this on your own okay so now that you have given it a try let's do this so if i write triangle aod okay i you can see the angles marked aod it is similar to triangle boc right angle a equal to angle b o and d equal to c now it's as good as done ao into by divided by do right the shock these two is equal to the shock these two is equal to bo divided by co and it immediately follows that ao times co is thing but po times oops do which is exactly the same result now what if this point o was outside the circle so somewhere over here and then we uh, draw the lines how will it change okay or will it change again let me take a circle i take the point o outside the circle all right and i draw these two lines again a b c and d now let's uh, look at how it will change 
we're going to use a similar strategy here okay we will uh, do construction find the angles then find the similar triangles okay use the ratios and then we get our theorem all right now here is the important part the construction is always the important part i'll connect this again these two again fine and now let's mark these angles this one will be equal to this one and this angle will be equal to this one so dab equal to bcd okay you can see why this is true because if i let us draw bd like this you can see these two angles will be equal and we are nearly done we can, you can you should you be able to find the similar triangles which we are using and then find a relation between ab bo do and cd or co okay so now that you have given it a try let me tell you this angle is common in those two triangles which we are going to take so you can already guess which triangles we are going to take a o d okay a o d it will be similar to a o d okay c o b triangle c o b like a is equal to c and o is common also this these two angles will all also be equal it follows and we are going to do the same thing again ao divided by do is equal to yeah co divided by bo and from this we get ao times this length times this one bo equal to co times do which was exactly our previous result not this times this equal to the big then length times this one right now hope it's very very clear now i'll give you a question okay so say in this circle we have these two secants coming all right and let me give you the values this is let us say 4 cm 6 cm and this one as 7 cm what is the value of let us call this x try this it's a very basic question and write the answer in the comments box okay so that's all that's it for today and as always thanks for watching